Hey guys, so for today's What I Eat In A Day video, I'm starting off my morning with a banana smoothie. These bananas, this is all the bananas I have in my house other than frozen ones. And they're perfectly spotty and I decided I'm gonna make a big smoothie today. It's been a while since I've had a smoothie for breakfast. I've really been favoring melons. So we're gonna make a smoothie, aren't we Brandon? Alright, so now I've added eight bananas to the blender, and that's all I'm gonna do for today. If you follow me on Instagram, you should know that I am obsessed with um, frozen cherries. I love them in everything. So I'm gonna add frozen cherries as well as these peaches that I froze up the other day. Don't forget to drink your water. I drink a liter in the morning and then I try and drink at least two more liters throughout the day as well as I drink around two liters while I'm at the gym which I go to about five days a week and I'll make a video on that but um, I'll make one with Sha because we go to the gym together. Definitely hydrate up. Now I'm adding some coconut sugar and now a little bit of cinnamon. So next, I'm gonna try and have these peaches. So I just put one whole peach in there, and now I'm gonna add water, so we'll see. So I filled this up until the water was about at the liter and a half line, and now I'm gonna blend it. So good. Those bananas were perfect. So now I just put my kapow lid on it. Sometimes some of these with this giant jug can be a bit difficult. They'll get into my face, so I like to use the kapow lid. Alright, so now I'm just gonna take some photos for Instagram while I drink this half of the smoothie. I'll see you next meal. Hey Brandon, what are you having for lunch? Actually, okay, so the uh and we're using the the Daya mozzarella style shrimp. And I just had some. All right, so we have a vegan quesadilla with some organic ketchup. And that's what Brandon's gonna have for lunch today. Because sometimes a little boy just needs a grilled cheese. So I've been sitting on my computer editing videos as well as fixing up our banner for our YouTube channel and um, so I haven't really made like had time to make lunch so I've been having this roasted red pepper hummus and just some naan bread and it's pretty high in sodium it's not the lowest in fat but it's not the end of the world. I just needed something quick to eat, and this is what I decided to go for. Um, I don't really worry that much about it because it's not like I eat high fat, high salt every meal. And I do go to the gym, so I sweat almost every day, and I drink a lot of water, so I think it's just like, you shouldn't stress about every single meal. If you're gonna have higher salt or higher fat, just, you know, drink water deal with it like sure I don't feel my best when I eat higher fat but this isn't that high in fat so I'm gonna eat it and I'll probably have something else soon because this isn't exactly like a meal but I'll show you then hi everyone so in about an hour I'm gonna be going to the gym so I'm cutting up some peaches to eat before then So I 
cut up seven peaches. Now I'm just taking some Instagram pictures. All right, so now I'm gonna eat these nectarines and then when I get back from the gym, I will probably have another meal. I will definitely have another meal. I'm always really hungry when I get back from the gym, so I'll show you then. So after the gym, Shaq and I went to Jimmy Guaco's and we got some burritos because we were starving and we still had about 30 minutes to wait before the bus came. And I just got home now and I'm eating some squash that my mom had made. And I've also been drinking some of this juice. Yes, I'm drinking it in between cooked foods, and no, I really don't care. It doesn't affect me that much. And yeah, also after the gym, I had a couple of figs, dry figs, um, on the bus. And I'm not going to do the chronometer today, just because everything I ate wasn't very specific. So, yeah, I hope you like the video.